We all know about small group tactics or fighting tactics, but what about radio tactics? Hello everyone, Dylan Schumacher, Citadel Defense, and we are back with another edition of Tactical Book Review. Today's book is The Gorilla's Guide to the Beofang Radio by N.C. Scout. Uh, I found, I've seen this book on Amazon here and there, uh, and then I saw Mr. Risky Krisky talking about it a bunch, and so I picked up a copy and thought I'd read it and see how it goes here. I tended to notice that the reviews that I like books on, the ones that are favorable, are usually my shortest reviews because there's not that much to say other than you should read it. And this book probably falls into that category. I really liked this book. I like this book for a couple of reasons. First of all, it does give you some helpful, like concrete, you know, scientific data information. Like these are the frequencies that you should do that are MERS frequencies, and these are UHF frequencies, and these are VHF frequencies, and like some helpful kind of concrete data. And then it builds on that and gives you more very pointed uh, ways to use the radio, right? This is a salute report. This is how this works. This is how you build a comm plan. You do this, and you do this, and then you do this. And it's very straightforward, very pretty idiot proof, which I appreciate, um, and really just explains it to you. And when I got done with this book, I realized that this book is really uh, a book on radio tactics. That's probably the best way to say it. This book is, helps you understand the tactics of using a radio. And, and I'm using that word a little bit loosely here, but what I'm really trying to get after here is this book helps you understand how to use the radio in context, right? It's not just like these are the buttons and these are what they do, although it has a little bit of that. It has a little bit of like how to build antennas and some encoding deals. But overall it's saying this is the way to use this radio in a context, in a tactical, you know, uh, which is a high threat environment, uh, context. That's how you're going to use this radio in order to accomplish your mission, right? He, the author assumes you're out to do something. And when you're out to do that something, you need to use a radio to affect what you're doing, to improve the capability of what it is you're trying to accomplish. And he helps you understand how to use a radio in that context. And so for that reason, I find it an extremely helpful book. Does everyone in your crew need to read this? Ah, it wouldn't hurt, it, it would probably be good. Especially if you, as if you consider yourself some kind of leader, you need to read this. If you're some kind of radio person, you absolutely need to read this, right? And it is the only book of its kind that I know of that again, hits that niche of radio tactics. This isn't just some old ham book to be like, and then you can talk to someone wherever, I don't care, right? What I care about is using the radio in context of trying to accomplish something. And this book will help you do that. So I would highly, highly recommend you read this book, uh, The Gorilla's Guide to the Beofang Radio by Mr. NC Scout. I will put a affiliate link in the description below. You get it if you uh, can. Again, highly recommend this book. So I do want to just say one thing here. You know, I got this book and I also got the Beofang AR-152 radio because Risky Krisky said that this guy recommended it in this book and I read the book and I didn't see it recommended in here. So you owe me 70 bucks, Risky. Do brave deeds and endure.